Hey, so I just got home from a trip. I went to a winter camp and I'm in my bedroom. I'm a little, a little tired here, but um, hey, I've been using this Coda UL backpack from Outdoor Vitals and I want to show you what I packed in it for the weekend. I want to show you how it fits and I want to show you actually too how I think this thing has way more room than I even thought it did. So let's go look at the pack. All right, so I've already thrown this thing on my bed. And what I really love about this pack, and I even found this while, while like I was packing my stuff in here. Like I can open pretty much every zipper one-handed. This is where I had my beanie. These are some straps that the backpack comes with. And I just keep them right in here. There's another pocket in here, if I can do this, where you could actually probably stash them. That might even be a better like pocket to stash stuff. Uh, I'll show you a little later in this video where I stashed my keys while I was on this trip. But I mean, look at all these little like zippered pockets and these areas. But do you notice that like, just imagine if you were doing this one-handed. That's what's there. Okay, so now let's find the big zipper. And here's one thing I love about this bag. Watch this. These zippers open all the way down on both sides. And so I can lay this thing completely flat. Uh, I got a Patagonia bag here. Now, you can see that this thing like looks pretty full, right? Now, and here's what I wanna show you. The, the last couple times I've used this bag, I've found this to be true. And uh, what, what you gotta do is you gotta zip this up again. And then you take this up here and like you've packed, right? And it's like, this is full at the top. But what I found is if I take this and just kind of shove it down here, do you, do you see that extra room that I get? There's a, there's a metal frame in the pack right here. If you, if you were to undo this and there's a laptop sleeve right there but even just that little extra room that i could get in there to add something more if i needed it look at this lay flat unzips uh, i have the vario jacket i brought this on on my trip this time this is an outdoor vitals jacket also Oh yeah, there you go, the Outdoor Vitals. I've made a video about this. Uh, maybe I'll put a link in the description if I remember. So I got that. You probably don't wanna see my underwear. Uh, you know, clothes. Here's to what I did for this trip. I didn't like roll everything. A lot of times I'll roll stuff and so that it's like super compact. I didn't do that. And I actually have some bulkier items. Uh, I wanted a sweatshirt on this trip. You know, I wanted that jacket. I'm just gonna throw all my dirty clothes on the ground. Uh, T-shirt, some socks. I even brought some big bulky sweatpants. I was up in the mountains, and if you know me, I pretty much only wear Volcom. So I was wearing those. Some more underwear, some more socks. These are some pretty dope stance socks. Check this out. Chilling with my snowmies. Felt like these were the appropriate socks to bring for going to winter camp. Uh, sleep shirt. And then I brought some boots. So I even brought some like heavy, that's gonna be loud for you, sorry. I even brought some kind of heavy duty waterproof boots that I could have here. And this pocket right here is where I stashed my key. But do you see that I can just undo this with, with one hand? I might even throw another little like video clip while I was at camp. I I, I showed where I stashed this because I, I just really like this pocket right here. I really like this bag, how it has this like lay flat ability to it. And you can take these down, like, like how I had more room. You could actually take these down. And let's see if I can do this one handed while filming. I'm not a YouTuber professionally. You can clip those. Did you see that? Did you hear that? Look, there's more. Let's see if we can do it again. Listen, listen. Clip. So then you can clip those. Make your bag a little smaller. They're on they're on this side of the bag too. Just 
this if you you know maybe you're starting lighter and you're gonna travel somewhere and then you're gonna bring home like clip a shirt for someone it's pretty cool clip and here's what else this bag has you, you might see kind of all these little like mesh loops that are in here we got all these loops and earlier i showed you i had i was keeping these up here and you can take these and like clip them in these mesh loops and, and sort of like snug your bag up together i outdoor vitals you guys were really thinking on this one i love this for traveling this this bag has been super rad for me uh, this is a packing cube. I've never even taken the thing off. I haven't got to use it yet. But you could actually take those straps and you could hook it on here. Make a little day pack. You could throw your laptop in here. So, I am... Oh yeah, I told you I put my key in here. Oh yeah, look. There's another pocket out here too. I put my... Uh, my wife and I got these. It's a it's a five year journal. You do one line a day, and we got these at the beginning of 2020. We had no clue what that was going to hold for us, but these have just been super cool to have. And even while I was packing the bag, I did another kind of video how I could show you to do it one handed. I'll, I'll kind of try to throw that in here. so you can see that too but it's just so nice to be able to have these zippers that are so easy to use and then within this pocket too you you got a mesh pocket here i think there's another one right here with a zipper yeah you got another zipper here you got some other stowaway stuff down in here there's even another zipper way down in here right i don't know if i can get to it and show you down here oh you can kind of see it yeah See that? You got another zipper down here. Like if I was traveling internationally, I'd probably throw my passport down there. But I dig this belt because I wasn't dig this belt. I dig this backpack because I wasn't gonna be in, be doing any hiking or anything. This was more just a like go to a one location trip. Um, I even took the hip belt. There's a removable hip belt, but I stashed it in here. Uh, I actually saw a video where Tayson, who's the founder of Outdoor Vitals, stashed it in here. I don't, I don't know if I'm going to get those out one-handed. Um, but yeah, this is kind of the back. And then it's got some handles. like So you can grab this backpack in several locations. There's even one on the bottom, if I remember. Yeah, And just kind of take that and and put it away. Or, you know, like if you're throwing it in an overhead container, if you're putting it in the back of your vehicle. So I just felt like I had to show you guys this bag kind of had all this stuff in it and it worked great. Now, if you were in the market and you were looking for this pack or you were looking at it, I'd suggest go for it. I'd pull the trigger. I, I pulled the trigger on the Kickstarter for it. I'm actually a Live Ultra Light member, which... I think meant we got like an early bird ability to get into the Kickstarter and I'd been looking for a pack like this. I was actually looking at the Osprey. I think it was called the Far Point or something. I don't know. I'm kind of tired. I've been traveling. But if you're looking at a pack like this, if you're considering uh, getting into this bag, I, I would just say do it. I would highly encourage you to go ahead and jump into it. For me, it's been a great, it's been a great bag that has like a multi-purpose use where uh, I've taken it, I've taken it up to like winter camps. I've taken it traveling for the weekend. We have a trip planned later this year, uh, to, to a tropical location. And I think, I think this is going to be the bag I take, just throw in some trunks and some shorts and call it good. Just kind of that one bag travel. So yeah, hope this is helpful. If you're looking at the Cody UL, hope this helps you.